Hello everybody, Master Gable here from Charleston Taekwondo Somerville location and today we're going to be talking about the Little Tigers Yellow Stripe curriculum and what we need in order to get each of our tips so that we can progress to the next level. For our yellow tip, we need to be able to do a nice kicking stance with a solid front snap kick. So we want to have a setup, a kick, and a finish. For our red tip, we're going to need to be able to count 1 to 10 in Korean. For our black tip, we'll need to be able to show our good horse riding stance or our punching stance and then do 10 consecutive punches. The green tip, we'll need to be able to do 10 squats again. The blue tip, we'll be able to sit for 30 seconds with no moving. And then for an added bonus, if we can, we're going to try to do steps 1 through 4 of our beginning form. So if we can get through all of these, we'll be able to get all the different color tips that we need in order to progress to the green stripe belt. All right, so let's get going over what exactly each of these different things looks like. So for our yellow tip, we do our kicking stance and we do our front snap kick. So we set up that attention stance, we do our big bow, yes I can, and then we step back with our loud yell making sure we put our hands up, bending our knees, and looking straight. Ha! I'm gonna show you with the other leg. So we set up, when the teacher counts, we do one front snap kick, ha! And then we put it away. So we point our knee, and then we pop it out and back, and then we return. Ha! We'll be able to do both legs for a couple kicks on each side to make sure that we look good. For our red tip, we'll need to be able to count 1 to 10 in Korean. We have a video showing this already, but we'll go quickly through it now. Hana, dual, set, net, dasat, yasat, ilgo, yadul, aho, ya. So being able to count 1 to 10 in Korean to receive our red tip. In order to get our black tip, we'll be able to need to be able to do our horse riding stance and our punch. So what we do is we start from attention stance again. We do our bow. Yes, I can. And then we go into ready stance. We take one step out. We bring our hands up. We make a tight fist. And then we push down. To make our horse riding stance, our left leg is going to step out one more time. We're going to bend both of our knees and we're going to pull our arms back and flip them over. And then as the teacher counts, we'll do a punch. We bring it out and we flip it like a pancake. Then the other hand will come out and they'll flip together. So when we punch, we punch fast with a loud yell. Ha! So we'll need to do this 10 times, and then of course finishing with our attention and bow. Yes, I can. For our green tip, we have to do our 10 squats. At this point, they've already done squats quite a few times, so they should be okay and know how to do that. For our blue tip, we'll need to practice being able to stand at attention stance for 30 seconds without wiggling and moving. Again, a lot of them can already do this because we practiced this from class number one. Finally, the bonus section is being able to do the steps one through four of our pattern or routine that they learn. So again, we start with our attention stance. We do our big bow. Yes, I can. And then we do our ready stance. We step, hands come up, and then we push down. Our left arm will come in, and then our left leg We'll step to the side as we block down for step one. For step two, we step forward and punch. Three, our front leg is going to turn to the other direction and we're going to block down. And then for four, we're going to step forward and punch. 
Now again, this isn't a requirement of the curriculum. However, it is something that we're really encouraging them to start learning because if they can learn it now, it's gonna make it a lot easier for them long term as they go through all the stages of Little Tigers and as they progress into our regular program. I'm Master Gable, and this is our tips for Little Tiger Yellow Stripe Curriculum. Have a great day.